I'll lock you in the car, and I don't want you trying to get out. I'm gonna have to break the window if you don't open the door. Come on, this is your last warning. I got here just in time. Hi, Susanna? I'm fine, how are you? Yeah, no, I'm good. I am just um, confirming our get together tonight. Yeah, and you said 8 p.m., right? What? Six? Oh my God, I thought it was eight. Oh, what time is it? It's quarter to four, 3.45. No, I, I'm still at school waiting to pick up um, my kid. No, 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 don't worry, I'll be there. I'll be there, don't worry, I'll figure something out. Okay. No, I've got Mike coming into the car right now. Um, okay, yeah, don't worry. No, I, I, I will see you, I will see you soon. Okay, I'll figure something out, bye-bye. Uh, I am uh, in a bit of a bind. I just found out that I have an event and I still have to get my hair done and I do not have time to take you home first. So what do I do? Well, you're gonna wait in the car uh, while I'm at the beauty salon. Mm, but I have homework to do. Okay, I understand that and you can do your homework while you're waiting in the car, okay? You can't drop me off first, are you sure? Yeah, no, I'm sorry, I can't. And I'm gonna lock you in the car and I don't want you trying to get out because I'm gonna hear the alarm go off, okay? Why do you have to lock the doors? Well, Mike, you're 11 years old. I, mean, I want to keep you safe, okay? What if it gets hot in here like last time you left me in the car? Okay, it, 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 it's only gonna be a, a haircut, 30 minutes, maybe. Maybe more. This is Florida. It gets hot in the car in 10 minutes. Okay, Mike, do not argue with me. You are not to get out of the car under any circumstances, okay? okay. And if it does get a little hot, well, suck it up. All right, you, you, you're not a little baby anymore. You're 11 years old. today? I know. Hey, is that the new kid from school? Oh yeah, I think it is. Look at him. What's wrong with him? Oh my gosh, he's doing the distress signal. You're right, I saw that on TikTok. He's in terrible danger. Open the door, open the door. I, I can't get it. Get out. Get out! Open the door! Open the door! Um, he's locked inside, but he won't let us in. What do we do? We've got to call the police. Yeah. Hello? Please, can you send police to Mango Park Mall? Our classmate is in a car, and he looks like he's about to faint. I try to open the door, but it's locked from the inside, and he won't let us open it. Please hurry, thank you. Don't worry, police will be here in any minute, okay buddy? I hope he'll be okay. Hi kids, I'm Sergeant Reed, what's going on here? Officer, please help us. Our classmate is stuck in this car and he looks like really bad. Yeah, and he's locked inside. Okay, son, are you okay? Son, open the door. He won't let anyone in. Yeah, I didn't Son, know Son, I'm gonna have to break the window if you don't open the door. Come on, this is your last warning. Open the door. Oh my God, it's like 150 degrees in here. Anybody got any water? We need some water immediately. I, I 
about water. Car unlocked. Are you kidding me? I have told that kid 10 times not to get out of the car. Okay, that's it. I, I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's my kid downstairs. It, it will just take a minute. He's in so much. This kid always interrupting me. I can't believe I'm walking around like this. Oh, I'm in so much trouble. Hello, officer. What's going on here? Is this your son? Yes, this is, this is my son, Mike. Well, these two kids called the police station and your son was locked in the car suffering from a heat stroke. I got here just in time. Oh my God. Really? If it was that hot in there, why didn't you just get out of the car? What are you talking about, Mom? You threatened my life if I even dared to get out of the car. No, I didn't. I simply told you not to interrupt me while I was having my hair done. That's all. Ma'am, your son wouldn't open the car door unless you told him not to. He wouldn't even open the door when I got here. How do you explain that? Please, kids these days. I mean, they don't want to listen to anybody, even a respectable officer like you. You know that. That's a bold-faced lie. Oh. Here's proof. What are you talking about, Mike? Yeah, show me what you have there, son. Seriously, please, Mom, I'm melting. No, don't you dare get out of that car. If that alarm goes off, you won't live another day to talk about it. Are we clear? Oh, I think I get it now. If I read this right, you are more concerned about your hair than about the welfare of your son. Is that right? Okay, all right, officer. I, I, I apologize. I admit that I used some pretty strong words in that text thread, but I'm here now. Okay, I'm just gonna take him in. I'll finish my hair appointment and we'll call it a day. How about that? I can't let you go after endangering your son and let you get away with it. Okay, so what is that? Uh, a ticket? I, I mean, whatever you're gonna do, can we just move this along? I mean, I've got a party to get to at six o'clock. Son, how far do you live from here? A couple blocks away. Well, how about if your two friends walk you home? Yeah, no problem. Sure we can. Okay, is your dad gonna be home soon? Mm, yeah, probably like around six or so. Okay, I'm gonna drive by after I drop your mom off to the station and then I have a talk with your dad. Is that okay? Okay. Okay. At the station? What is going on? Turn around, ma'am. You're under arrest. What? For what? Willful endangerment of a child. Are you crazy? You deserve it. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. I, I can't go to the station with my hair looking like this. Really? Really, ma'am? You're worried about your hair at a moment like this? Well, don't worry. Before they check in at the station, you're gonna get a wonderful buzz cut. You still no, won't no, forget. No, I can't let them Let's ruin my go. hair. Hey, what about my rights? My, my one phone call? My lawyer? Isn't there another option besides a buzz cut? 